Welcome one and all, and we're in for a real treat at this classic circuit here today. The crowd are ready to go, the cars are ready to go, and we're just about set for lights out. Welcome to the Italian Grand Prix. With top speeds reaching 215 miles per hour, only a few places can challenge Monza's crown as the fastest circuit in F1. Hard braking zones going into the three chicanes make up the majority of the 11 corners on this 3.6 mile circuit. And just in case the slipstream wasn't enough, two DRS zones will help encourage some closer action. And as always, a man with plenty of racing experience joins me in the commentary box. Today, it's Anthony Davidson. Tell me, Ant, you're no stranger to surviving the melee of turn one. So how do you keep out of trouble when there's so much going on around you? There are three main things to worry about there, Crofty. Positioning, awareness and discipline. First, you have to put your car in a bit of space and make sure you have room to react to what the others are doing. Then you have to watch your mirrors and listen to the sounds around you to get a sense of where everyone is. And finally, just don't get too greedy. Just because a gap exists doesn't always mean you should go for it. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. It's Sergio Perez on pole position today, and Valtteri Bottas will line up alongside. As we continue through the rest of the grid today, we have Hamilton, Verstappen, Sebastian Vettel and Stroll, Sainz, Sonoda, Ricardo and Esteban Ocon, Fernando Alonso, Gasly, Lando Norris and Leclerc, Raikkonen, Mazepin, Antonio Giovinazzi and Mick Schumacher, Latifi and George Russell ends our grid lineup. It's almost time for those five red lights to go out. Then let's see who can prevail today. Okay, here we go. I know what you can do. Don't let me down.
nice move. Good job. We can now use DRS. DRS now available. That's the end of the race. We'll see you in Park Ferme. Here we are then, a thoroughly deserved win in Italy after another excellent Grand Prix. Anthony Davidson, how do you think they were able to set themselves apart today? Well, they certainly stood out as a driver with tons of confidence on the track. I think their ability to keep their cool, even during some of the more hectic parts of the race, meant they were able to capitalise on the mistakes of other drivers, giving them the opportunity to make their way to the top spot with ease. Red Bull put up an outstanding fight for the front position today, and it's great to see it paid off for them. They do so much for the sport that you can't help but be delighted by today's race win. So, Anthony Davidson, who would you rank as your driver of the day? Kimi Raikkonen is my standout today. Nothing you could construe as showboating, just an incredibly consistent performance out on track. Well, Ant, an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you...